Emily is very passionate about math and giving kids access to learning math. I like being in Miss Sinkson's math class because I feel like she really helps us understand the problems and like helps us work through them. I like being in Mrs. Sinkson's math class because she's a really good teacher. <laughs> she's really helpful. She believes strongly in running a classroom where students come in and they have a structured environment where they are exposed to math concepts and have access to those math concepts no matter what their learning abilities are. So my name is Emily Sankson and I have been in the district now for 13 years. I was at Plum Grove for seven and Carl Sandberg for six and now I am teaching here at Thomas Jefferson Middle School. Some of my favorite things about working in District 15 is um, the collaboration that can happen. Uh, so our instructional coach was very instrumental in coming into my classroom and helping me brainstorm different ways to think through things. And then um, I've had a math coordinator come in my room and she was also very helpful in helping me change things up. Like, I don't think I've ever had a math teacher that's been like, so like wanting you to succeed and wanting you to like get the right answer. Cause um, and I was given um, a book that was just a different way to teach math called Building Thinking Classrooms. And one of the things in that book was just getting kids to think in a much different way and putting the heavy lifting of thinking on them instead of me being the one who does all the heavy lifting. I feel like what's unique about her is that like she helps us work through it in like a way that like we like in different ways like she shows us different ways that we can do the problem like there's not just one method to solve everything. So I was able to help my coworkers with that a little bit and that after I read the book then as a school at CS um, along with our instructional coach we were able to also read the book so the district purchased them and then we did a book study that whole year um, and then additionally I was able to have other people from other schools in the district they came in and they saw how things work in my classroom. Um, I think the big thing is that when you first start, you need to establish routines in your classroom that really force the kids to do all the thinking. Um, and so implementing some of the strategies I talked about a little bit earlier, and then also becoming a good questioner. We are so lucky to have Mrs. Sankson as a mathematics leader in District 15. Not only does she create an engaging classroom community, but also collaborates with other District 15 teachers to create the best math experience for students.